Two. Some passengers experienced extreme turbulence. I believe 24 were injured. Uh, do they have a case? Uh, first of all, first of all, just listen to one of the uh, of the people on the flight uh, describing what happened. Roll tape. All of a sudden, uh, we dropped probably about 100 feet a second. And it's, uh, it was horrifying. Anybody who didn't have a seatbelt on pretty much whacked their head. Now, Emily, I don't know whether they're going to sue or not, but if they did, do they have a case? They have a case here because what I see happening is that the airline will settle out. Now, of course, there's an assumption of risk that's printed on all of our tickets that say we're not responsible for death or bodily injury. But at the same time, these airlines like to maintain a good public face and a positive public report, in which case I do see this settling out before it hits court. So they can sue and it will be settled. That's your opinion because it's such an extreme case. Okay. Correct. That's and I suppose they could say JetBlue should have flown around the turbulence and didn't, so it's all your fault. I suppose they could say that, and they probably will. All right.